So we're drinking some sweet coffee. My cousin got us this Vietnamese coffee brand from, I think she got it from LA. Either she got this from Costco in LA or this is from Vietnam, I don't remember. It's TNI King Coffee. Usually we drink the Vina Cafe one, so yeah, I'm excited to try a new coffee today. Still do not have a kettle, so we're using a tiny pot. Alrighty, taste test. Let's see if Howell notices that it's different coffee today. Definitely does taste different. I think I did too much water. It's kind of diluted. Hot. It also tastes kind of nutty. Hmm, I think I like the other one better, but maybe just because I think I did too much water. All right, on the agenda today, um, it's Saturday, so that's our cleaning day. We're gonna do laundry, vacuum the house. Other than that, debating what to do for lunch. We have leftovers, but it's not gonna be enough. I still have some century old egg, so maybe I'll do that actually. Maybe I'll do a century egg congee and then we'll also eat the leftovers. I have my water about to boil here and usually we use uncooked rice but um, I'm a little lazy for that and we also have cooked rice already so just to speed up the process I'm going to use my cooked rice. My century eggs here. I'm gonna use about four. Um, yeah, let's crack these open. So beautiful. I like to cut it in about six pieces. Not about six pieces, exactly six pieces. Alrighty, so in goes our eggs. Ready. We're also having some leftover chicken and zucchini from last night. Hello, it is 11.10 p.m. right now. Um, I was just FaceTiming my dad and we just hung up. Um, and now I'm gonna do my nails. I have my bottom retainer on if um, I'm talking a little funny. Hal and I went to Superstore earlier and I picked up some nail polish. It was basically free because Hal has a lot of points. 
on his MasterCard. And so we just used the points to pay for my nail polish. So I got a bunch of Essie quick dry nail polishes. This is color Buns Up. It is a mauve beige. I'm really bad at describing colors, but yeah. Next we have Party Mix and Match. I don't know what kind of color this is. Um, like a fruit punch. And then I have our true, true red here and it's called Seize the Minute. My nails are relatively short. Um, I'm not sure what color to do. Maybe I'll try buns up. Yeah, let's do that. I don't know how some people have such nice nail beds and such long nail beds too. My nail beds are super short. I think maybe it's because I used to like push underneath my nail when I was younger just to make it a round shape. Actually, I think it was probably my doing, but also just genetics because I don't think any of my sisters or my brother have um, long nail beds. I tried FaceTime with my mom earlier, but she didn't pick up. Usually on Saturday nights, I FaceTime my parents. When I FaceTime this time, only my dad picked up and usually my parents are together, so. Um, yeah, I'm able to talk to both of them, even if I just call one of them. Yeah, but this time I was only able to get a hold of my dad. I'm debating to cut my hair. I kind of want bangs again. I feel like I cut bangs every... I don't know, the last time I cut bangs was when? Maybe like 2018? I also cut bangs 2012, I want to say. Um, so yeah, I guess every... Every five, six years I cut bangs, so 2024, I guess it kind of makes sense that I want them again. I also want to cut my hair maybe like sh medium, maybe short to medium length. Maybe I will do that next weekend. Alright, I'm gonna go in with buns up. I'm not ambidextrous, but I think I do a decent job of painting with my non-dominant hand. After three coats, this is the nail polish. It's so cute, right? I think this is the perfect nude for my skin type, hands down. Mm, super cute. Alright, I'm happy. I'm glad I chose this color. Alright, I'm gonna wait for my nails to dry and probably go to bed after this. Bye! but I just I just want to have something up because this wall is so plain so I'm just gonna work with what I have and hopefully I like it all right so the candidates are I have this mirror here this picture of carnations that my parents grew 
And this is the first oil painting I ever did. Um, I just followed a Bob Ross video. Um, I don't know if I will put it up. I don't have a frame for it, but this is a possible candidate. I have these two pictures. This one is just leftover wrapping paper that I framed from my first hosted Christmas. Um, and then this is a picture I took when I was in Vietnam a few years back and it's just fruit at the market. This is a shadow box of my wedding bouquet. Um, I just dried up the leaves and then put them in this frame. And then lastly, a little touch of home, just the um, lunar calendar. A hack I see for gallery walls is to get like just scrap paper and cut out all the sizes of the items that you want to hang up and then tape them to your wall so you kind of have a temporary arrangement before you actually nail them to the wall. So I'm going to do that. Mirror should be here, about here. So. If you're wondering what the buzzing is, or I'm not sure if the camera's picking it up, but if you are hearing a buzzing, it's because Howell's in the garage right now sounding our console table. It feels a little high, but it's because I wanted the mirror to be eye level, but sh should the mirror be lower? I feel like a little lower would be better. It's just too high. I think I nailed those too crooked, and so my frame is crooked. Looking a little cute? I think so. 